Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Baklava Maora. Today I'm making a traditional Albanian dish, summer dish. It's called fli, which is made with cornmeal. Today I'm preparing it with green scallions, summer onions, and spinach thawed and squeezed with a tablespoon of salt combined together and with uh, two eggs mix it put it to the side in the other bowl you take two cups of cornmeal white cornmeal i'm using this dish you can use yellow cornmeal so about two cups of that and then you take a tablespoon of bacon powder tablespoon of salt I'm using Himalayan salt you can use kosher salt for this we're gonna put mix these together all the dry ingredients then we got our wet ingredients combined with half a cup of yogurt I made homemade yogurt so you can use your own plain yogurt bought or you can make your own whichever is in your fridge with one cup of cold water, not hot, cold water. You mix this together and your baking powder is gonna activate so it's gonna get very bubbly. With that said, you need a cast iron, really heavy dish, a cast iron. You preheat your oven at 350 and then we put one cup of um, white flour, all purpose flour to this mixture too. And this is gonna be our base. We're gonna butter all our cast iron all around and the bottom, grease it well. And then you're gonna flatten all this mixture of the cornmeal. Once you butter all the cast iron all around, as you can see, I'm going to put our layer of cornmeal at the bottom and pat it with a spoon down. Make sure it's all even thickness, not one side thick and the other side is thin. So make sure I bowl it and so it's all even. And then we are going to put our spinach and our scallions mixture in there as well over the base. So we are going to also add our feta on top of our spinach and green scallions. That's what makes the dish much, much flavorable and much, much delicious. So you flatten it with the rubber spatula, make sure it's all even all around. Now, um, before you do that, make sure your oven is heated. Do not put your cornmeal in there and cornbread or flea, whatever you want to call it. We we'll put it in all even our scallions on top and we pat it dry and damp with, with this fork. We just dab it down so it's almost like incorporated inside the actual cornmeal. And then we're going to crumble some feta on top. Here I have a half block. So for this amount of um, pan, this big pan, you just put like half a block all crushed and crumbled over it. And then uh, we are going to put another layer of corn. Welcome if you're new to my channel. This is Baklava Maora. I'm making corn flea, which is made a traditional Albanian dish. Summer um, onions and spinach and feta the combination of three it's to die for it's so delicious you can't stop eating this dish i'm telling you all guys you make this dish and really really it's outside the world how delicious the combination of all of those ingredients together so now i'm putting some dry cornmeal on top you don't need to wet this you just add dry cornmeal evenly all across the top I want to say about a, a cup and a half or two just the same amount as the bottom but this Cheers. is dry so we're adding now um, half a cup of cold water with uh, four tablespoons of yogurt mixture 
and we are going to add a one egg to this mix it together and just spread it all around and make sure that it's all incorporated all the make sure it's wet before you before you put it in the oven so we're just going to spread this with a spoon gently and make sure there's um, enough liquid on top so this is going to give it a nice crust and in it it's going to taste like uh like you just it's just so crunchy so delicious and the colors and absolutely this calls uh, like uh, it's called a summer dish because it's just beautiful it's green it's beautiful and make sure you don't spill it too oops and you just add it to the whole mixture slowly and then you add on top of this we're going just to design it with a fork quick quick before it starts to uh, clump up and dry on you so we're going just to design it with a fork some lines or you could just leave it plain no problem this just gives it a lot of good texture and then we're going to add some bits of butter on top so something softened butter we're just going to spread it all over a little bits of butter and then we're going to put a dish underneath this another pan a larger pan this is heavy cast iron so just in case a bubbles out and you're not prepared to clean the stove and a smoke and a grease trust me people you should put another pan underneath thank you for watching until next time don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment Spakla Mara.